what they've done with these poppies down here looks so nice doesn't it yeah it's really really pretty on every lamp place or what they've done to the town hall is quite moldy nice isn't pumpkins. it oh yeah oh moldy pumpkins yeah now my wheels in motion and my everyone and welcome to Thursday how are we all doing today get yeah, the boys went off school about 20 past eight again absolutely fine no issues there woke Ben up this morning just after seven he woke up really happy really smiley really giggly and even when I put him on his bus he actually gave me a kiss as well which was really lovely again it's nice to see him so happy after what he's been through Obviously, last year we didn't think lockdown really affected him. Obviously, he had all his medical issues, but he was replaced Ben with his happy Ben. Can we keep him, please? Because it is it's definitely what of our mind and stuff like that. Knowing he's going to school, he's enjoying school, he's actually learning now, which is really, really great. Obviously, when you come home with that crown thing he'd done the other day, um, apparently, he'd done most of that himself. Like I said on the vlog yesterday, trying to find some big, chunky um, paintbrushes because obviously, he lo absolutely loves painting. And oh God, I couldn't fully find any yesterday in Banbury. Obviously, I'm, I think I might have to check Amazon. I'll see if I can find anything off there. So, anyway, yeah, and also his teacher did email yesterday saying obviously they're working on their Christmas movie. So, could we send in like a Christmas drum for some tints and some Christmas bits for Ben? So, later on, I'm going to pop in the garage, see if we can find some. I know we've got some, definitely got some tints on somewhere in the hat. And obviously, when he comes home from school, I need to try his drum prom and see if it still fits him because he's grown so, so much. He really has. And obviously, but anyway, at the minute, I'm waiting for my sister to come. She, and we're just going to have to um, post office. She's got a few things to send off from her orders, which she's made. And obviously, we've got a few eBay orders to go off as well. So, yes, yeah, so I think today is just going to be one of those days when we're spending, like, spending more with my sister, which is really, really nice. And then, obviously, then this afternoon, we need to find these bits out for Ben. Like this now. So, yeah, so me and Becca here. We're just off to the post office now, aren't we? Yeah. Um, like I said, I've got some eBay orders to go. So if you're watching this and you've ordered from our store, thank you very, very it much. It's like It's like way. What's that? The yeah, they are on the way, yeah. <laughs> so they are on the way. Normally I get them actually picked up from the post, well, from the postman. I think you pay for extra 70 p or something like that. But again, oh. it's nice to come out. What's the matter? Uh, What's the matter? We found... Work. Oh, the Christmas craft fair. Yeah. Oh, that sounds good, isn't it? The kind of Nashby Christmas concert, all the oh. things on there. And oh, the, the lantern. Christmas... Oh, the lanterns. Yeah. That tractor run looks pretty fun, doesn't it? Yeah, I, I, I think we're, we're going to go watch that. Where is it, anyway? Um, so, like, so like you, it starts on like Edgar Hall and it goes all the way through town. And then oh, right. That was so probably like, like there. Yeah, it's so like... You, you can stand on like um, down the road and stuff. Oh yeah, could do yeah. And you know, also, it's, it's going through town. And also, that's one good thing. Got the fireworks. Well, it, or you can do it at home. Oh yeah, well, we're not going to be here gun. though. No, because we've got the light train at Warwick Castle. I didn't realise until so I booked it. So that we've only managed to book that. I think it's the nineteenth of December. No, no, it's somewhere. It's, I can't remember. <laughs> okay. But it's sometime in, in, in December. Cause that's the only time we could book it. Yeah. I know we got. I know we got stories to Santa book for the fifth of December. Yeah. Um, um, well, I, I know quite quite a lot of people are having issues with booking because like all like, the dates are all blo like like blocked out. So we're like they've released more pass go. holder tickets, I think. Yeah. So quite looking forward to the light trail, though. Yeah. Okay. Really, really am. Um, so Apparently, said there's over a million lights or something. Oh, is there? So that'd be quite nice. And then. Um, they read a poem or something of the Christmas story or something. Oh, so, 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 like, is, so like the light trail. So is that where the haunted hollows was? Yes, it's all around the grounds of the castle. Oh. It takes us a forty-five minute experience. Oh wow! So, well, I'm, I'm really forward. yeah, it's going to be pretty good actually, isn't it? Yeah. Really, really good. So anyway, yeah, we just reached the post office now, 
and hope fingers crossed there won't be a cake. Look at all these yeah. poppies down here, it looks so nice doesn't it? Yeah. It's really really pretty on every lamppost. Oh what they've done to the town hall is quite moldy nice isn't it? Oh yeah, oh mouldy pumpkins, yuck. My pumpkins were in the green bin. So yeah, so, so it looks, they do, it looks so so pretty. It looks really, as like I said, it looks really all tumbled down here as well doesn't it? Yeah. Anyway, I'll show you what they've done to the town hall. In a minute. Do you need boots for anything? Are you right for boots? No, I'm okay for boots. I just see the bank. Just see the bank. Oh, yeah, you need to pay some money in, don't you? So, yeah. So, yeah, so we're just in the car up now, aren't we? About to get Dad's milk. Yeah. It's like a new selection box. So it's not bad actually for a pound, are they? That's a cute little tin of shortbread, isn't it? I like the tin. That's four pounds. Oh, not too bad. Got a couple of tea tins there. You know what? It's quite scary seeing the Christmas things in the shop. It really is. The stuff mince pies. What are they? Oh, they're smarty things, aren't they? Different. Oh, I think I covered it at the right time. Look, got some gluten free crumpets. They went absolutely love those. Yeah. I get some of them. Just need to get Dad's milk as well. Well, see what four pint green is, does, doesn't he? I think. Well, they haven't got any green. They've only got the Cravendale. Um, that's all they've got. Well, there you go, right at the back there. I can see it. So yeah, as you can see, they've got their five for five pound offer back again. And it's actually the pizzas this time. So what, their pizzas are really nice, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, you get like some chicken dippers, garlic bread, chips, onion rings, and ice cream, oh, all they for five. Any pizzas, it's just garlic bread. Yeah. Well, so what? We've had a couple of these offers before, and they're really good, aren't they? Because you save, you save actually you save them quite a bit. With the yeah. price of them, seven pound sixty, you get more for a fiver. On there around Christmas time, they do six, don't they? Six or seven or something like that. Yeah. Um, well, that's the first time it's there. They do free from cones as well. It's 2 a.m. and I can't fall asleep because I'm not tired. I'm thinking about the days we used to shine when we were young I told you that we should start a band and reach for the sky It's 2 a.m. and I can't fall asleep, I'm just not tired I can hear the raindrops falling, it's cold outside And I kind of feel like now to get Ben's what? Oh yeah for handrails in for some notes actually. So yes we just walk around to the chemist now to get Ben's and my medication. We went around after sleep and picked it up from dad's we went around it wasn't ready then was it? It should have been ready Tuesday but apparently they've only just got to it so in fact they've had quite a few orders and things like that which is fair enough. As long as we get Ben's epilepsy mass that's what matters isn't it? Mm. Anyway yes as this was walking round while oh, it's gone we got followed by this like this grey tabby cat so <laughs> it's quite funny isn't it which one first um let's go into let's go into the pharmacist first i think get medication pop into tesco's and get some pasta sauce i think so, yes we're just in tesco's now seriously wants pasta for tea i think they made some sort of bearer there look that's 165 for 750 gram that's 165 for 500 gram Do you know? i haven't got a clue how that's worked out with you so we technically you're better off buying the big the big one Aren't you? What you got there? Some leeks and some mushrooms, yeah? So just... So, I think so. But no, get, get something away just in case, you know what I mean? Might as well. I, I know Ben's definitely got pasta, hasn't he? Got some cheese, yeah? Which one do you fancy? That one there? Or do you fancy that one? Yeah, get the yeah. air. So that's £3.15. Or that's only tea for £3.50. Cheese Thinking about a cheese tummy, you know what I mean? Just get some. Oh no, that's only two pound sixty. You best look at that's eight pound per kilogram. That's eight twenty nine per kilogram. So they're about the same price actually, aren't they? Really, to be honest with you, really are. Yeah, if you think is you get the grated cheese, it's easier. You know what I mean? Let's get with your cheddar. Let's get two packets of those. Yeah, might as well. 
They think here would you take your fancy? Well, they look nice. Those for the cheesecake slices, didn't they? One pound seventy-five. Just get those things. Yeah, might as well. Yeah. Oh, they look different. Digestive Christmas puddings, Tesco Club car price are a pound. Ooh, or the gingerbread ones. They are, aren't they? Yeah. Regular price of them is one pound thirty five. When you taste it, it just tastes like a digestive. Probably, yeah. What we'll Stephen's putting out, they look do look nice, don't they? Chocolate orange truffle. Ooh, they sound nice too, don't they? I quite suppose you don't want some of them, darling, actually. You know, you know like with Oreos. I'm not a big lover of them. You know, what? Not really big lover, you, know. you used to love them. What's the Tobro and Everett calendar? Yeah. Oh wow. Only a pound. Oh, I'm seven so, pounds. Yeah, you can see we just had a couple of packages delivered by DPD. Don't get me wrong, they said they're gonna be here between quarter past three and quarter past four. It's now quarter to three and they've just turned up, so at least they haven't to wait too long. Anyway, as you can see they are our Merlin passes obviously you can see we've gone for the monthly pass because the original price of them was £229 that was in your rate I just thought they were just far too expensive for um to be honest we couldn't afford all that all in one day so we've gone for the monthly one and they have £20 a month they are so it wasn't too bad obviously gone for the platinum ones are the most expensive ones you can get and it doesn't give you no restrictions either and they do discovery gold and um, I think it's if it's a standard as well, I'm not too quite sure, but obviously they give you restrictions and stuff. And I thought these from these these are going for these ones we can go during school holidays and weekends. I well, know with restrictions there's certain dates you can't go, especially during bank holidays and stuff. So yeah, so they look they look different compared to other ones. They look quite smart actually to be honest with you. They really do. So they just like the normal ones we had before with the Leonard and the pop badge and the um Fast track passes and stuff, if you can open them. Because right. obviously you've got Ben and Sammy's in there as well, haven't we? Mm. And one thing is, on it's this time, they didn't do the carers passes. Well, they do still do the carers passes, but they do it digitally, don't they? Mm. Ooh, they look nice, don't they? Mm. They look nice and smart, those ones. Have they got the little thing you could in there, the plastic clips? No. Yeah, which we'll have to yeah. take them off the old ones. Yeah. Oh wow, they look nice, but don't they? Mm -hmm. Really, really nice. What have you got in there? Is it still the same in there? Oh, they'll give you it. Oh, they'll give the clip. Oh, that's good. Yeah. What's on the comfort on the bottom? What's that? Oh, yeah, so you've got some share the fun vouchers. Bring a friend for only £15. Ooh, they look posh, don't they? Mm. I know what Sammy'd be after. <laughs> yeah. And then obviously, you've got some fast track vouchers as well. Well, that, that's what I was suggesting to and then Thought Park and Alton Towers. So yeah, so these are nice and good. Merlin Holiday Club, um, welcome platinum pass holder. Because I know they do certain discounts as well for like all the hotels and things like that. So I know next year Sam said he wants to stop in the Chessington Hotel. I've actually sent this in the letter here. Welcome pass holders to the fantastic world of Merlin. Thank you for buying the Merlin annual pass membership and pairing for stuff for your the fun. Well, the thing is, they're, like I said, they're just from your rates anyway, from obviously because we love our Merlin attractions of all our theme parks and stuff. Obviously, what on Alton Towers we've never been to, so comment down below if you've been to Alton Towers. We we'll definitely need to make a visit there next year, I think. Obviously, Thought Park, they've got all the bigger rides and stuff, so yeah, so. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we should have. Yeah, so it's five to four now. The boys have just got in from school. Ben's just chucking into his fang things. They're like the normal cheese plus we buy them, aren't we? They just change the shape, obviously, for Halloween. So I think that's the last packet I'll get from then. You enjoy them, my Sita? Were they nice? Yeah? You absolutely love them, don't you? You've that nice smile on your face. Yeah, it's had a good day at school as well, haven't you? You had a good day. <laughs> yeah, you had a good day at school. <laughs> yeah, so if, you, if only you could tell us what you've actually done, isn't it? Eh? Like, we'd love to know what goes on in his Ben's and things like that. What's the matter? You're right. Yes, yeah, so like I said, had a really good swim as well, which is really lovely. And yeah, hey, what's the matter? What are you doing? Grab my hand. What are you after? What are we after? Hey? So yes, it's lovely to see him so happy and so contented and stuff like that, even though we're having to wake him up in the mornings, aren't we, for school? What do you want? Do you want a biscuit? Do you want a biscuit? What are you after? 
What are you after? Hang on, what have you done? Hang on, you made a mess. So anyway, sweetheart, how was school today? Very good. Yeah, what have you done at school today? PE and everything. PE, what else have you done apart from PE? You can't tell me you've done PE all day. Yeah. No, what have you done all day? What have you done all day apart from PE? I've done language, maybe say, and instances in PE. Oh yeah, that's good. What are you doing in PE? Everything. What do you mean everything? I'm I've done something different than PE today. What did you do? What, what was that? <laughs> I've done... It was. I've done... I've, have, I've run around in the hall. I you went around? Went around in the hall? Yeah. Okay, that's different, isn't it? Yeah. Run around in the hall, but... It was better than right coming back on the bus. Yeah. That's good. And what was school doing today? Um, it was Rose Gammon. Rose Gammon. You like Rose Gammon, <laughs> don't you? And with that guys, another vlog says goodbye. <laughs> Can you believe we are rosily coming to the end of another week? Looking forward to the fireworks display this weekend. So um, a bit warning for you guys for Sunday's vlog. There will be flashing images on that video to do with the fireworks. So I thought I'd let you know that right now. But anyway, I'm looking forward to it. It's been such a long time since we saw a display. Two years. And... Um, one thing I'm going to be looking forward to next year um, when we're on holiday is seeing the Great Yarmouth fireworks on the Wednesday evening. You remember that, Cheryl? Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, that's if they're on, of course, but, you know, hopefully they will be. And it's not it's nice to see the fireworks out to sea. It used to be quite a thing we used to do when we, when we used to go down there. But anyway, guys, yeah, that does today's vlog. Thank you very much for joining us today. As always, subscribe and comment down below the usual thing and we'll see you tomorrow for friday bye guys